By God's grace, we shall reach the whole world. the word Yeshua, Jesus, the first time I was, this is weird, um, who's this? And I kept listening and then I heard all the blasphemies for me as a Muslim, like he was God himself appearing in a flesh. And I was like, wow, this is crazy. And then I heard he was crucified, he had our sins uh, on him and I was like, this is insane. Who are these guys? At the end, they gave the, the, the address for the program. I wrote it quickly. I still remember I wrote it on my hand. And I was so full of anger and upset because they are using the Arabic language. They speak like us, but they are preaching different message. So I wrote a letter, a long letter. I think a few weeks later, they, they sent me a response. That started a whole process of correspondence back and forth. That radio station that I listened to, it was TWR. I tell people always, I, I don't know the date, the exact timing of when I was born in, in faith. I started doubting my faith and leaning toward the Christian faith progressively. So I sent a letter to my friends in, in TWR. I told one of the guys there, I, I think I'm a Christian because I have nothing in Islam left. They told me, we will connect you with somebody local. Who is this guy who lives here in Morocco and has the same thing like me? We made an appointment to meet downtown and then we met. And he started asking me all kind of questions to make sure that I understand the Christian faith. And at the end he said, I think you're a believer. And he said, would you come if I invite you to a meeting where people like you meet? And that was a shock for me. People like me, what do you mean? He said, Moroccans. I said, Moroccans, Moroccans? He said, yeah, Moroccans, Moroccans. And I was like, I thought I'm the only one. He said, no, no, there are so many like you. And then I went to this meeting I found out all of them almost have the same story. Radio, correspondence courses, and then coming to faith. It's almost identical with the whole group. And that's why I still believe in the power of gospel using media. Every uh, young guy I met and who became a Christian in that frame let's say from 1980 until almost 2000, I ask him this simple question, how did you hear about the gospel first time? He will say TWR. 